and I'm back with another video. Um, as you can see, we are applying the set that we just did. Um, if you're new here, um, I recommend you all see in the last video the Black Frenchies. That's what we're doing. If you're interested. Um, with that being said, welcome to any new viewers, new subscribers, any returning ones. I love the returning ones because y'all return. <laughs> Thank you so, uh, so much for taking the time to view this. Um, it's going to be a little short, short something, something. Um, I do want to say ahead of time, I'm not going to be showing y'all me top coat and the nails. Just because a um, couple of the nails on her left hand, for some reason, it don't fit. Like, it's as if, like, I don't know. Like, this is why, y'all, we got to check the numbers before we just start going ahead and putting acrylic on and stuff. Because I'm pretty sure I grabbed the right sizes, but, like, I didn't check. So, I always do check, but, you know, I be so, like, so assured of myself when, you know, you should always still check just to be sure. Because times like this where I felt like I was sure and you know the sizes was wrong i'm not saying that's what exactly what it is sometimes the acrylic can shrink the nail or sometimes you might overdo with filing that happens um so yeah i'm not really sure why but either way i gotta redo those two so she's just gonna come back sunday um and do that and you know let me um go ahead and put those on for her and so right now y'all just gonna see me prep her nails this is how i keep my nails last in like three plus weeks y'all for real like my um her friend her pinkies is mad strong on on her nails like the rest of them came off um but her pinkies is strong as heck and it's been over three weeks <laughs> so i'm gonna have to soak her nails um so that's like it's giving very like salon finish nails like they're very durable they last um just as long as you're not like out here trying like lift boulders and and really trying to make them come off and stuff like then yeah they're gonna come off but um and it's gonna be painful but yeah so moving on um i'm just prepping her nails y'all i ain't really gotta do too much i normally would just push back the cuticles going with my nail file um just to like get underneath and like loosen it up some more so that the um the nails can slide underneath or whatever not really underneath but push the y'all will see i can't really y'all know i'm not that good of an of a, of a explainer like um <laughs> but i would push it back do the drill to like i don't even know what is the spirit bit or whatever to like clean underneath the cu cuticles and then i would just go in with my cuticle nipper and just nip the dead skin or whatever but she doesn't have any she don't really ever have any like dead cuticle skin um nor her friend it really just be me <laughs> but um that's what i would do that definitely helps um so if you have any dead cuticle skin or whatever i would definitely get that so the next time i do my nails i will definitely show y'all i was trying to show y'all with this set but um my phone had died like right in the middle of it like when i was about to be finished so i was like i need to, these nails to be on and i couldn't really wait for my phone to turn back on to show y'all so we lost that footage but um like i said the next time i will show y'all how i do mines and y'all can see exactly what i mean um so yeah i'm not gonna do too much talking y'all will see everything that i do and everything that i do is necessary and is what helps keeps my last my nails lasting um three weeks plus y'all don't don't say nothing about what's underneath my nail okay i had some ribs this morning my yours what did you have this morning <laughs> okay what did you have it wasn't as good as my ribs i know that <laughs> but all right chill i'm gonna chill yo and y'all this beat right here that joint's too too sick like it's too hard all right i'm done
cycle. Okay, y'all, so now that all the prep work is done, y'all see me um, sizing the nails to make sure that the nails fit before I start gluing them. And that's how, you know, I saw that a couple of the nails um, didn't fit, which, you know, this is why you gotta do that before you start putting on glue. Um, so now that, you know, I see that it fits some from sidewall to sidewall, I'm just gonna go ahead and press up into the cuticle with the nail and go ahead and press firmly um for about like 20 seconds or so and then we're gonna move on to the next nail um and i was like trying to fix the shape like the the tip of the nail i just be trying to crisp it and then doing that i be removing the polish so i have to go in with more polish but i'm going to stop doing that because <laughs> it just makes things go longer but like if I don't know y'all like i like it when it looks really crisp if i feel like it needs it i'm gonna do it all right i'm gonna do it <laughs> Go. Okay, y'all, so we are about at the end of the video because, like I said, um, I top coated all of this off camera just because um, I was a little discouraged because of those two nails, y'all. I was like, you know what? I don't even think I'm going to be uploading this video, but I was like, you know what? I might be able to get something out of something um, because, for one, like, I just thought, like, why not just record one hand? Like, because I want to post these and I can't, I mean, not can't, but I choose not to wait until Sunday to, like, show off her nails. Like, I'm going to just get one hand because, shoot, that's what I be doing with me. So, why not? That's all y'all need is one hand. Ain't nothing really spectacular going on on the other hand. So, um, yeah, y'all know what to do. Like, sweet, sweet comment. Killer Nails underscore. Follow on Instagram. Subscribe, y'all. I'll catch y'all in the next video. We finna get started on this next set, this next order. I'll see y'all. Peace.